Okay, here we are with our second interview with Big Cheese and Man. We have some really, really enticing questions for him. Now, how do you feel about the current economy? It sucks. My cheeses are still fairly expensive, and I, I can't find work other than doing these stupid interviews. The only reason I'm doing these stupid interviews is so I can buy the big cheeses. Really? Yeah, it sucks. So how does that make you feel? It makes me feel sad. Because you know, being big cheese it man here, I enjoy my cheeses. Yes. Well, being out of work, it's hard to get my cheeses. Of course. Okay. If you could have any job other than the ruler of the cheese and empire, what would it be? Oh, that's a tough one. Hmm. Hmm. Is there anything other than the Lord of the Cheese and Empire? Um. Hmm. I think a cheese with factory worker. Because, you know, working there on the factory line, as some cheeses come down the conveyor belt, I can just scoop up all I want. Uh huh. I'd never have to buy my big cheeses again. No, you wouldn't. If you could be president big for one day, what would you do? Make big cheeses the national food. Everybody would be entitled to their big cheeses. We would have big cheese at holiday and everything else. Big cheese at wise. Really? Really? That's great. Yeah. Now, what would you do if you served as president for a whole entire term? Every day would be big cheese a day. But did you do anything about the war in Iraq or the economy? Give all the guys over there big cheeses. Load up the guns with big cheeses, so they're shooting big cheeses at each other. Nobody gets killed by big cheese at fire. Not really. No. That is great. Now, if you could be any animal forever, what would you be? A cheetah. Really? Yes, because Chester Cheetah of the Cheetos Man, he is my best friend. Really? And I would love to be a cheetah. He's really fast, gets all the Cheetos. And I could be like, uh, uh, Big Cheese It Cheetah. Yeah, I like the sound of that. Big Cheese It Cheetah. A Big Cheese Big Cheese even better. Thanks, cameraman. Huh. That's great. That sounds fun. I want to be a cheetah. Mm -hmm. A Cheese A okay, Cheese If you were the Hoff, what would you do with your life? Am I the old Hoff or the young Hoff? The young Hoff. Well, I would do all them hot chicks that are on Baywatch with me. How about Old Hoff? Yeah. Old Hoff? I'd shoot myself because, boy, did I let my body go. Wow. But you're the first judge on America's Got Talent. Sure. I hate that show. Really? Because America don't got talent. They're all a bunch of friggin' stupid people that think they got talent, but they really don't have talent. Yeah, most of those guys are. Sometimes. Except for that robot guy. Oh, wait, that was, uh, you think you can dance. Yeah, never mind. No, there there was a there was an actual robot guy on that show. <laughs> Seriously, an actual robot, and he's going to Vegas. Oh. Or no, wait, he already made it past Vegas, so he's going to LA. This is my pet. Parents. Hey, that used to be my cat. Yeah, it's mine. Yeah, yeah, well, my dog doesn't like cats. Yeah, well, I don't like cats either. Yeah, it's mine. Yeah, well, my dog doesn't like cats. All right, let's get back to this interview. <laughs> my football doesn't like either of you. <laughs> Where did that come from? Cameraman. <laughs> <laughs> Man! Anyway, if you were being interviewed by the Hoff, what would you do right now? Fall asleep, because he's boring. How about Young Hoff? Oh, yeah, Young Hoff. Young Hoff, I'd be like, damn, you look good. What if I, you had... I'd probably be tempted to turn gay, looking at the Young Hoff. What if Young Hoff also had Pamela oh, Anderson with him? I would get him out of the room and have my way with her. Of he had all the hot chicks from Baywatch with him. Oh, that'd be heaven, man. That and a box of big cheeses? How about the Party old time. Hoff? What if he tried to judge your appearance? I don't like the old Hoff, so I could care less about the old Hoff. What if it, there was old Pamela Anderson with it? Eh, I'd still do her. <laughs> Alright, next question now. Hello? I'm thinking. Are you out of questions, Mr. Interviewer I Guy? I believe I am. Well, I guess that concludes this interview, don't it? No, what's your favorite snack food? Do you really need to ask Big Cheese it man what his favorite snack food is? I can think of another question. Just give me a second. It's pizza. If you could be in any type of band, what type of genre of music would it be? Heavy metal. Really? Yeah. 
cool. Big Cheese enjoys his metal. Would you be a guitarist, a singer, or a drummer? All. All? All. You'd be a one-man metal I'd band? I'd be a one-man metal band. A one-man band. Not really. I'd lay down the track for my guitar, <laughs> lay down the track for my bass, lay down <laughs> my <laughs> drum track, and then sing. <laughs> You're just like Trent Reznor, dude. That's it. Nine is nails. They rule. <laughs> Next. If you could be one type of kid's toy, what would you be? None. None? I don't like kids. I hate kids. Kids are evil. I'm 13. I'm a kid. Yeah, I don't like you. You're a fat kid, and I really don't like fat kids. What about me? I'm two days younger. I don't know. Are you fat? No, you're not a really little fat. bit. You're okay. You're not a fat kid. Sweetness. Oh. Hey, <laughs> fat kid. <laughs> this concludes our interview. Don't throw that at me. Don't throw that at me. I can throw it at you, cameraman. Oh, oh. All right, that's it. Big T's at man's leaving. Yeah. yeah.